kids, welcome to another story time with Teacher Tracy at my farm. Today I'm going to read another one of my favorite books called The Big Red Barn by Margaret Wise Brown. Helping today, yet again, is my pony, Mr. Sullivan. By the big red barn in the great green field, there was a pink pig who was learning to squeal. There was a great big horse and a very little horse. And on every barn is a weather vane, of course, of a golden flying horse. There was a big pile of hay and a little pile of hay, and that's where the children like to play. But in this story, the children are away. Only the animals are here today. The sheep and the donkey, the geese and the goats were making funny noises down in their throats. An old scarecrow was learning on his hoe, and a field mouse was born in a field of corn. cock a doo doo In the barn there was a rooster and a pigeon too, and a big white hen standing on one leg and under the hen was a quiet egg. There was a bantam rooster and a little bantam hen with a big clutch of eggs. Count them, there are 10. cock a doo doo There was a big brown cow and a little cow. <laughs> there was an old black cat, meow, meow, and a tiger tomcat, meow, meow. There was a big red dog, bow wow, with some little puppy dogs, all round and warm. And they all lived together in a big red barn and they played all day in the grass and in the hay. When the sun went down in the great green field, the big cow loud and the little pig squealed. The horses stomped in the sweet warm hay and the little donkey gave one last spray. There were hens sleeping on their nests. Even the roosters took a rest. The little black bats flew away out of the barn at the end of the day. And they were all there all night long sound asleep. In the big red barn. Only the mice were left to play, rustling and squeaking in the hay, while the moon sailed high in the dark night sky.